You could easily live a lifetime and never see the Southeast Asian Siamang swinging and singing in its natural habitat. But the same could be said about the majestic sable antelope and hundreds of other animals that now live in southwest Dade County. They have all taken up residence at the sprawling Metro Zoo, a 160-acre complex that opens to the public on December 12th. Nearly 10 years in the planning and construction phase, workers are now putting the finishing touches on a major portion of the $19 million park, which promises to be perhaps the finest zoo in the country. For a few of the animals, that means some last-minute training. In this case, just a little coercion. Baby elephants are supposed to like the water. Metro Zoo is cageless, perhaps the only totally cageless zoo in America. That means an experience you will likely never forget. I think from the public coming to view it, it will be an experience uh, which will be unrivaled in anything else they've perhaps seen before in the majority of the zoos they've been to. It's, there's nothing between you and the animals except space. That's it. Space. It gives you uh, attention and a feeling that um, as they track you or follow you down the walkway that I wonder if you could really make that jump. And so, I wondered the same thing. <laughs> I'll assure you that they can't uh, and if they do they'd probably jump right back in again because they feel very secure in those habitats. They're fed there, they've staked out their territory they would be more concerned on the outside of that than they, they would probably jump right back in. We certainly hope he's right. Bob Mayer, Channel 4 News at the new Metro Zoo.